Hey, what's up, you guys? Time is back. Got the wifey with me. Hi, guys. And we are back with another Linsen's video. Um, so, since you see the wifey right off the back, that obviously means we have a together fragrance to review. Mm -hmm. And man, the fragrance we got is actually a brand new one from Russell Wilson and Sierra. The couple, if you guys don't know who that is, um, that is the football player and the singer. Right? Yeah. R&B singer. R&B singer. Singer. She does uh, the one of those shows where she has to judge people on their talents and stuff like that as well. Russell Wilson plays football for Seattle Seahawks. Right. Married couple. Got kids. They're so much in love. You know, she moved on from the future and <laughs> went to Russell. Um, Good choice. But man, so... The guy, they actually have their own website just dedicated to the fragrance that we're going to be discussing. Um, we'll link it in the description below. Here is the box. The R and C standing for Russell and Sierra. Now you get two 1.7 ounce bottles in here. And the cool thing is, is when you open it up. Now, I mean, if you didn't know that was fragrances, you might have thought something else. But we'll leave that for the adults to figure out what they're thinking of. But this is how the uh, bottles come, like this, if you want to call them bottles. But they look like this. And the cool thing with these is that they cannot stand on their own. They have to be together to stand upright. Which is a good metaphor for a marriage, right? You should, guys, you guys should uh, always stay together. Now, it's a weird little bottle. It's like connected by magnets, and it stands like that. So, if I was to take one of these away, it does not stand, see? So, it's just going to fall over. So, like she just said, a good metaphor, good way of thinking about this fragrance is to stay together. If you got a strong woman, strong man, you stay together. The magnets keep you together. But at the top, as you can see, it says R and C when you're looking at it from the top. And I believe the R has a, a and symbol right here, if you guys can see it. You can see that right there? Yep. So when you're looking at it at the top, it says R and C. So that's a pretty cool, unique bottle right it there. It also kind of looks like a chromosome, if uh, you like yeah. science. Or a, uh, what's that other? I guess like a, when it's intertwined like that, it means together, right? Yep. The infinity sign. Something like that. <laughs> now, when you pull these apart, hold it. They feel a little cheap. So it's, you know, it's going to look nice on, you know, either a dresser or a, a nice stand, whatever, or, it's you know. heavy, though. It's a little heavy, but if, I don't know, to me it feels a little cheap. Like the material is kind of iffy, but the weight is pretty good. So as you can see, I do have the Russell one. It's the R. And there's the C right there, if you guys can see it. There it is. So, um, there's actually a lot of notes in this, but uh, I'll actually go through that pretty quickly for you guys. Um, in the opening for Russell, we have a blend of black tea with bergamot and some um, and broxen. And then in the hearts, we got, uh, let's see, lavender combined with juicy pear and blossom. And then at the end, we got water lily. We got some... Uh, patchouli, musk, and vetiver. So this is probably just going to be an all-around sexy, mm -hmm. uh, together-like fragrance. So when you want to be close, this is going to be sexy. You're assuming it's not going to be too loud because you don't want to attract everyone else. You just want to attract the one that you're with. So I'm assuming these are going to be kind of closer to the skin, as you will. Uh, but I don't know. We'll have to see. Mm -hmm. Right? So I'll spray the Russell first see what you guys think of it and then after that we'll discuss what's in Sierra's fragrance she'll spray it and I'll let you know what I think of it we'll both smell them together and we'll see okay so again weird bottle shape so like you it. almost gotta you're gonna have to move this sprayer in a different way to because it's kind of weird when you're holding it but here we go let's see if the atomizer is pretty nice pretty nice it's actually a real nice sprayer actually um, wish this was magnetic but Actually, I'm smelling it right in the air already. 
I haven't even put it close to my hand yet. But definitely getting a lot of those citruses from that bergamot. Um, like a little juicy pear in there as well. Getting that nice little musk and vetiver in here as well. I think that's what I'm smelling. I don't want to be acting like I know what I'm talking about, but yeah, this is definitely a nice, this actually can almost be any time to be honest. Um, I don't feel like this is just for a date night. This could be during the day as well. Um, it's definitely going to be one of those, like I said, as long as you guys are together, you guys are both wearing the fragrances together. And I'm assuming the fragrance that she has, the Sierra version is going to be kind of like something that the two can kind of blend together. That's what I'm assuming. So we'll kind of spray it and then we'll discuss if we feel that the two together kind of smell good together, I guess. So, mm -hmm. But man, it's definitely a nice, sexy date night fragrance or just daytime fragrance. Um, I'm not sure if I would classify this as a wow fragrance. It's not like it doesn't like literally blow me away, but it is definitely nice. It's definitely nice. It's citrusy. It's pair our little florals in there as well mm -hmm. probably from that uh blossom but this is very nice um again bottle when it's together looks very nice on its own i'm kind of not a <laughs> fan of this thing i mean it looks like a limp sausage hot dog wiener slash thingy but that's that one uh we're going to discuss the notes in the sierra portion of the fragrance and uh at the top we got juicy red berries with freshia and an unmistakably freshness of pink peppercorn. So that should be nice. And in the heart, we got a bouquet of white flowers and delicate peony. And at the end, we got some, um, let's see, musk, sandalwood, and vanilla. So you're definitely going to get a nice little sweetness at the end with the vanilla. Um, but man, right at the top, you're going to have like a nice berry note, like it says. And then freshia, I think that's like a floral note. Um, Pink peppercorn, that should be nice. Nice little spicy, floral, fruity scent. So you go ahead with that and oh, okay. spray Mine away. Right, it was ready. But like I said, the, the sprayer is kind of unique. It's, I actually like the sprayer a lot on here, on this bottle. It's probably the best thing about this bottle is it's the sprayer. Powerful. Um, but let's see, let's smell it. Definitely getting those like berries right up front. It actually of, smells really good. Like a juicy red berry. What berry? I don't know. I would say more strawberry, if anything. I um, but I think it's that berry and that freshia. Because I, I don't know what freshia smells like. I know it's a floral note. It kind of smells like cherry. Like a cherry. So it could be like a there. fresh cherries or, you know, juicy cherries, juicy berries with that floral note. Um, let me see. Am I getting any? I do smell a like vanilla. And I'm not a vanilla fan, but it actually smells really good with these other scents in there as well getting a little bit of that pink peppercorn in there but that is definitely nice um so you got the freshia flowers then you got white floral notes like it says peonies in there mm -hmm. which is a nice floral note as well but that is very nice now like what i'm gonna do is i feel like her fragrance is a little stronger than mine you think so i think so like because like yours pungent. is kind of popping off the hand a lot actually it's like man, those berries actually—that smells real good, guys. That. Like you can see the oil. Uh, if you get this, the wifey's gonna like that fragrance. You're gonna like it because I like it. It smells really nice, um, mm -hmm. pretty nice and seductive, actually. So um, this one, I, I don't know. Like I feel like this one is like fading pretty fast. But maybe it, she can smell it better. I can smell it pretty good, but it's not as like as pungent or loud as it was when he first sprayed it. And you've it. seen that spray too, so and I only sprayed one. So Russell Wilson, man, I don't know if you got sacked up a little bit. Maybe you're fumbling the ball a little bit with this fragrance because you know it's a sexy fragrance. Don't get me wrong. Maybe you're supposed to be close to the person to smell it. But you're putting your nose on it. No, I'm saying like you gotta be close. That's the sexiness of it. Like that's more of a really sexy fragrance. Well, hold on. Let me try one more thing. Let's see. Maybe does it smell better on the neck? Smell. It does. It smells really good. So it it smells really nice. Um, citrusy. Like a cookie fragrance. Like a little end. floral. 
And that could be from the, I think there's some kind of sweet stuff in the end of that as well. But it's floral, citrusy, it's nice, sexy. Only thing is, I mean, on my hand, it's, I mean, I can still smell it I can pretty well. I can smell it. But let me smell that. Maybe I mean, maybe it's just like the in, the notes in there are just more strong because the notes that I got in mine are the, the tea and bergamot, so citrus and tea. Usually citrus and tea notes usually do fade pretty fast anyways in other fragrances, but mm -hmm. you would. Ho I was hoping this one would be more stronger like the men. This one is not as strong as that woman's. Hers is coming off pretty strong still. Um, Again, I only did one spray of mine. He did two. But let's see if we can like... Smell it trying to give a little whiff of maybe like a to it actually makes togetherness. It like a if, really like, good fragrance together. So if you're like maybe you guys are both together and then maybe like another couple with walk past you and then they kind of get a whiff of you two standing together like, man, what's that going on there? Um, you can kind of go in there and be like, boom, you got the sex toy fragrance. Whatever this thing is. This Even though that would hurt because it's not around at the top. So that would probably hurt. And but it doesn't vibrate. There's no bad. Well, we uh, shake it up a little bit. Maybe to fizz up the alcohol stuff in there. Fizz up a little bit. But anyways, let's get off of that. The fragrances themselves, again, unique bottle. Again, they cannot stand without each other. So that is very unique. Very nice bottles. Um, fingerprint magnets, as you can see. Our fingerprints are all over this thing. So... Um, you're gonna have to, and that's the thing. I mean, look how it's made. Like, see, if I want to, like, you know, rub it down, I gotta do this thing here. I mean, I guess I can go like this, but you know, I'm not gonna get the fingerprints there, so you kind of gotta get no. it. Oh, I, don't, really I don't know what they're thinking with these bottles. The bottles are cool, I like them, but again, like. You got to put them in a way, though, that the magnet connects, though. You can't just, like, have it this way. There's no magnet up there. So there's the magnets, I believe, right in these little um, little things right here, these little parts right here. They're right there, so then they come together like that. But, again, it's a really good metaphor. So you got to have the right marriage to work together. You got to have the right. Yep. Together, stand yep. tall, stand proud, right? But. I'm the only one standing right now. He's sitting. Give you one last quick smell of this real quick. I'm starting to get that like that mm. musk dry down. I kind of want to touch my hers. Palate. Let me see. Man, she's still got those berries. That vanilla is coming through. That's very nice, you guys. Um, that fragrance alone, the Sierra part, is definitely good. Like, I mean, if they were selling these individually, I would actually tell you guys go out there and grab that one. Mm -hmm. That's definitely a nice fragrance for the lady. You're gonna like it. Um, if I recall now, uh, so you guys know the price on these were, I think, 90 bucks for the pair. Again, that's two 1.7 ounces, so it's 3.4 all together. And I think the cool thing is they're donating some of the money from the, the, the money that they make off of these. They're donating some kind of charity or some kind of cause. So that's a good thing about them. They always seem like pretty cool people. You know, I don't know them personally, but, you know. I love to see hang them. out with them. You know, but. There you guys have it. I believe we might be the first with this video because I've only seen like maybe one or two of the videos up like this. So we might be like one of the first 10 to have this. This is actually a very new fragrance. It actually just came out on the 18th, I believe. And we actually got it like a day or two ago. So first in line. But there you guys have it. The Russell and the Sierra fragrance that comes in this cool little box. You should turn it around. There you go. It's got like a little bit of information in the back. I think that's just the... Uh... No, it actually, yeah, it tells you the notes on the back. So there you go. Mm -hmm. There you go, the notes. That's pretty cool. So you don't got to go finding it on the website and just look at it right here. We could have been doing that the whole time instead of reading our phones, but it's right there. You know, sometimes they say the best things are actually right in front of you, right? And we needed this, and it was right in front of us the whole time. Just like a man didn't even look. We kept looking through the phone when the, the the instructions were right there the whole time. Everything was right there. But, oh well. This fragrance was very nice. I like it. Definitely the women's fragrance was definitely amazing. So, mm. if you guys are watching this, either a lady is watching this or a man is watching it, 
Just go out there, buy it. Even if you don't have a loved one, wear both of them. Because you can't, you can't just buy one, I don't think. You got to buy the set. So um, if you buy yourself, yeah, spray spray uh, one on one side of the neck and the other on the other side. Then you can uh, wiggle your head around and smell like both of them. Okay? There you guys have it. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you guys did, hit the like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Peace out. Peace. Yeah! Uh, I thought we were growling. Ah! <laughs>